back on the morning brew with you i'm larry aarons with aaron muffaletto and a guy we see around the studio quite a bit in fact he's run our cameras and done all kinds of things on our show <laughs> philip torres is with us today and he runs a program called phi cap and hey phil good to see you man good. thank you good morning good morning you don't like this side of the camera though, do you? <laughs> yeah that's not my favorite place yeah to be. right <laughs> all right phi cap yeah, so we've heard a lot of great things about this uh, organization. So tell our viewers a little bit about, first of all, what is FICAP? <laughs> um, well, it's a film, in, in, in a, um, what do you call it? Uh, apprenticeship, a program. Right. And uh, it's held here at U Public Studios in mm -hmm. conjunction with the city of Albuquerque and CNM. Uh, and the mayor's office, uh, which is part of the city of Albuquerque. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's an intro to film for juniors and seniors in high school. It's a dual credit program, so they get college credit and they also get a credit for high school too. Oh, wow. So, and it's held here at the studios, so they get to get off campus and, um, you know, be a part of a professional setting. That's really great. So how big is the group usually? Um, it varies. <clears throat> the most we've had is like about 25 students and then sometimes we have about 15. Mm. Yeah, so everybody gets a lot of hands-on experience, and um, I try to get them onto uh, professional productions also. Like, we had a couple on the TEDx event, um, the TEDx Women event yeah. in December. Yeah. Uh, this semester is going to be pretty uh, busy for, uh, for the students. Mm -hmm. We've had a chance to work with a few of the students that have come out of this program or who have been in it, mm -hmm. and they're terrific. They're very really professional. fun. Yeah, very yeah. professional. You, mm -hmm. it, you teach them every, it, the craft of producing film and TV is is very precise. There's a protocol to everything, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and uh, and the program is is quite intensive. Yeah, yeah, um, and that's one of the things that we try to um, you know put a focus on is the set of etiquette. You know, so that's very important, especially if you want to get hired in the, the program. Uh, you know, gears everything towards them finding a place, you know, in the film industry or wherever they may end up that's involved with uh, film in their career. Mm -hmm. So I, I think it's a very important thing as a professionalism. Um, so we go over that a lot and making sure they're um, on time and, mm -hmm. you know. What's the age range of your students usually? Um, <clears throat> Uh, it depends if they excel or not, but like 15 to 17 or 18. It's juniors and seniors, so mainly. We have a video. Uh, let's, uh, let's show a little video of uh, this class in action. Here's uh, Phil and his group of FICAP students. Two people per camera. We need an extra person on the boom. Two people to be sitting there and two people to be sitting there. Go. Go, go. We've been working a long time to get Running Start for Career started. This is a perfect example of what we're trying to do. We want students to have opportunity. We want the uh, industry to have workforce development. And those two things can go together tremendously well. But we want industry driving that curriculum and we want industry teaching that curriculum. When you step out of your high school shoes and you go on, I want you to be, I want you to have a head start. What I heard from the students today was exactly what we're hoping for. They're excited, they're engaged, they have options, they can see opportunity on the horizon. Can I turn it on now? Yeah, turn it on. If that helps them get more engaged and more excited and stay in school and increase their graduation rates and then help them with their grades uh, through their normal schooling and they can walk out with a diploma in one hand and an advancement on, on a career in the other hand, that's what we're trying to do. So kudos to you public what you're doing here because it's uh, this is exactly what we're trying to do. This is so cool. Now, one of the awesome things is about this is that it's free too. Mm -hmm. So how, like if I'm a student and I see this and I want to get involved, how do I? Um, well, they can contact me or, um, you know, if they're already signed up for CNM, have already applied, then mm -hmm. they can just uh, enter the CR, the course number. Okay. And, um, you know, we can provide them with that information. There's the, there's the phone number and email. Yeah, so they can get a hold of me directly. Um, you know, uh, the, the teachers at the schools, the counselors, uh, CNM, everybody's really helpful. Mm -hmm. They haven't applied or, you know, they haven't been in any CNM classes and they can just apply online. Um, it's just a few steps. And uh, for the most part, it seems like a lot of them already signed up at CNM. Okay. And your first, and your class coming up is January 27th. Mm -hmm. And that's about a four month class. 
Uh, yeah, it's uh, it starts next Monday and then um, it, it goes all the way to the 23rd of April. Okay. Yeah. So Good. We a lot of time together. <laughs> Hope we yeah. find some new uh, new talent out there. Yeah. Yeah, that I'm would excited. be fun. A Who lot knows? of talent out there. <laughs> yeah. There could be the next uh, Larry and Aaron too, uh, <laughs> lurking in the in the group. As long as they don't Wait try a minute, to take my let's job. not have that happen. <laughs> <laughs> but um, no, it's a great bunch of students. Yeah, and it we is. look forward to working. You, you may have seen in the video that uh, the, the set looks kind of familiar. Yeah. So, yeah. <laughs> real good, okay. Phil. Good to see you. Uh, uh, I hope you we found a few more students for you, but it's always a big program and and uh, we, we look forward to working with your uh, students to yeah. be in the, in the near future yeah, here on this show and others. Cool. I, I just think it's such a great program. Free class and free college credit. <laughs> wow. All right. Awesome. <laughs> Philip Torres runs the FICAP program. And uh, if you want more info, just go ahead and contact Bill or that website uh, email phone thing right there. Okay. <laughs> we'll be back in a moment. My good friend Joe Benal will be here, a local author. He'll be along. Tierna Anru Enos with the city of Albuquerque, the city's fun ambassador. There's lots <laughs> going on. Oh, yeah. Aaron and I will return in just a moment here on The Morning Brew. Mm -hmm. <laughs>